Hey, how's it going? Today we're going to be talking about uh, never missing a practice. So if you want to learn more about never missing a practice or about creative disciplines, uh, stick around. So the concept of this video is what I call the Michael Jordan practice, right? So Michael Jordan, every day, no matter what was going on, he would practice the basics of dribbling, passing, rebounds, you know, that sort of stuff. And it just it just tells you so much about the guy and the way that he would think and how he became such a legend, you know. And the, the reason I'm saying, like, never miss a practice is I love this idea of if you knew eventually that a painting that you made is going to sell for, like, you know, $4 million or whatever, some really large number to you, if you knew that a painting someday was going to sell for four million dollars or as much money as you want it to be why would you ever miss a day of practice you know to get there why would you miss the opportunity you know and it's impossible to know if it's ever gonna happen but the idea of always working towards your goal a little bit more every day basically means that it's eventually gonna happen like that's just how the universe works that's how things go about that's how masterpieces are made that's how creativity becomes real in your life and that's what it's all about so whatever you're really trying to get amazing at just practice a little bit every day and practice the basics of it every day you know like so I'm a wood sculptor this doesn't relate to anybody but I'm a wood sculptor I sharpen my saws every day and whenever I feel like I need to practice, I start carving a bear or something really basic for me. Um, you know, if you're a piano player, you got to practice just, you know, the chords of the, right, once a day. You know, a painter, you just need to pick up the paintbrush or start drawing. If you're a coder, just do a little bit of code, the very basics. And it's like, it just builds upon everything, you know. So if you never miss a practice, imagine how incredible you're going to become. Nothing's stopping you except for yourself. And never missing a practice is really going to improve your life. So, you know, I'm thinking I wanna start, uh, you know, lots of things, marketing companies, real estate stuff, and the very core foundation of a lot of, the, of sales stuff is making a sales call every day. So I try and make one sales call every day, even if I don't want to. And eventually that's gonna lead to great success. Um, for my carving and stuff, like I said, I car sharpen my saws every day and I carve a bear if I feel like I need practice every day or I carve something. I just get going and I get started. And I never miss a practice, or I try to never miss a practice. I travel a lot, so there's things like that. But in this video, you know, being a personal blogger, never miss a practice. Why waste an opportunity to make a video, make some content, get it out there and blow it up? You know, you never know when life is really gonna happen and as long as you're slowly, progressively building and building and building, there's nothing that's gonna stop you from becoming who you wanna become in the future. So, and sometimes you don't know where you're going, but there are things that you are trying to build. A skill set, you know, if you're trying to write good copy, uh, try writing a, a little sales pitch every day. If you're trying to blow up your Twitter, make, send out a tweet every day, you know, if you're trying to get better at call of duty just turn on the thing and put the disc in you know but never miss a practice and it just goes for anything any business any skill any creative endeavor think about what the most basic uh, the basics of what you're trying to do are and do them every day and then get better at them every day and if you never miss a practice man you're gonna become a master or you're gonna become you know someone who is a renowned authority in your field you know and there's like, you know, the 10,000 hour thing where once you do something for 10,000 hours, you have, you're officially an authority. And, you know, I kind of believe in that, but the real truth is if you really want to have some mind blowing action going on, is think about how many people there are in the world that aren't doing anything. And if you want to make money, you always get your money from somebody else. And if you're just that much better, one practice ahead of everyone else, and then you could teach them, that's how much money you could be making every day if you just keep up and you keep practicing and you stick with it. That's another thing. It's like, and it should be stuff that you enjoy doing. You know, I don't necessarily enjoy making sales calls, but 
I like money. <laughs> I like selling stuff and I like getting better at my craft and I like getting better at growing businesses and I like building things, you know. So if you just do the very basics, the very essence of what you're trying to do every day, you're just going to get better and better at it. And it goes like I said for reading books. If you start with the easy stuff and you just keep at it, eventually you're going to move up to the harder stuff and the more complex stuff and you're going to start getting a well-grounded field of knowledge in whatever your endeavor is trying to do. So never miss a practice, you know. I wish I worked out every day, but you know, that's something that I think everybody should do too. I try and run and I do yoga and I Never, I, I meditate a lot too. Those are things that I need to work on, never missing a practice, and I'm sure there's a lot of other stuff, but the stuff that really matters to me, I do every day, and I make it like clockwork. I don't necessarily have a set time or something, but they recommend you know you set a certain time where you do these things, but I just make sure that I do it every day, and I, I don't care if it's 11.59, I start doing the thing, the practice that I need to do for that day, and I keep it up, and it's taken me all over the place, so. If you're in a, doing something creatively, right, you're going to have to do a lot of hours and you're, it's going to take a lot of time and it's going to take a lot of experiences. But if you just do the Michael Jordan practice of you practicing the basics, you know, the dribbles, the passes, the rebounds of whatever industry or whatever endeavor you're trying to do, it's going to take you any, it's going to take you far, man. It's going to take you farther than everybody else that's not doing anything today. And that's a lot of people. And like I said, if you're just one class ahead of everyone, then you can be the teacher. <laughs> and you can get paid for that much more experience than everyone else. So, never miss a practice. Kick ass. Be creative. Let's do this. Peace.